Cancer. Welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well. We have got Treasure Island here. Beautiful. Now this is a tortoise that is swimming towards his treasure here. And this is a nine. So you're moving towards uh, blessings. Definitely moving towards blessings. We have Boat. Boat. Uh, act from your innate wisdom. Arch Archangel Per Perlimenic and Pan, God of Nature. I don't know if I've even pronounced that right. But this is about you being wise. You're acting from a very wise place and it's moving you towards um, blessings, most definitely. So you might be on your way to achieving something here. and You're nearly achieving your goal. Um, if this starts to resonate, please like, share and subscribe. Spirit, can you please give me the guidance for this message, please? Show me the guidance for this message. The Four of Swords, the Ace of Wands, the Nine of Wands, the Two of Cups, the World card, which is overall central energy here, the Judgment card, there's major decisions having to be made here. This is you starting up new ventures here. The Five of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles, two aces on the table and the World card and the Fool card. Yeah, absolutely. So what we've got here is we've got challenging times. When we're saying act from innate wisdom, these are karmic lessons that you've been through and it's very challenging time just now. So what we're doing here is we're, we're learning and gaining experience in life, in a certain area of your life. It could affect one or more area of your areas of your life. But you feel as if it's been one thing after another. And what's needing to happen here is these challenges are needing to end. The blessings that we have here, if there is a, the upside to this, because I don't feel you're very, feeling very enthusiastic at the moment. I feel you're feeling very challenged. But the upside to this is that you can put an end to these lessons and you're learning and growing so you're starting to understand about your situation your predicament your environment however this resonates with you wherever these challenges may lie now we're saying act from innate wisdom so use the um the knowledge that you're gaining here it, you're becoming more enlightened that's what i'm trying to say here uh, about a path that you want to go down now there is disappointments here and upsets and feeling left out in the cold and abandoned so we know that this is a challenging time. Now, we don't want to be focusing on these disappointments because what will happen is we'll continue to be challenged in life. What we need to do is, fives are change for me, we need to come into the present and look at what we have got that's stable that we can build on here. So these people are outside this church. If they looked up, there's always refuge we can seek somewhere in another area of your life possibly because these challenges could be within your work life your environment your relationships or your finances and one like i say can affect the other so wherever these disappointments lie we need to let the disappointments go it's time to take a step back here and it's a time to reflect on what you're learning definitely what you're learning because this is a, a karmic lessons are going to serve you well uh, it's about pampering yourself as well taking time out now you could be healing from something the healing period might be needed here so you could be if there's some of you been ill you might need to take a step back from things and look after yourself here self-care is definitely important at this time now we need to reflect on what we've been through we need to look back and review things uh, and the and you know understand here the lessons that we've been learning and use this to make a judgment call. Now, there can be brainstorming attached to this Four of Swords energy. So, you know, brainstorming, thinking about how you're going to go forward. A major decision is needing to be made here to end these challenges. And you are wise enough now. There's enough knowledge that you've gained here as you went through this experience to know the decision that needs to be made. Now, the universe is going to support you with this decision most definitely. The angels and spirit are supporting you here. They're trying to help you with make this decision here and help you with it. So take time out, definitely. It could be deja vu situations. It can feel like you're going through the same challenges all the time. If we're realising that if we go about ourselves the same way, we're coming out with the same outcome, we need to look at that. You know, we need to make a judgment call in relation to that. It can be people from your past coming back that have been challenging, that were disappointing for you. What we need to do is make a judgment call based on 
our previous experiences, most definitely. You've got the wisdom here, Cancer. You've definitely got the wisdom. Now, when we go from this nine, there's your tenth one there. There's your tens, and tens are endings. This is ending your challenges. And what Spirit's saying is that you need to start up something new. You need to take up a new opportunity here that's going to inspire you, that you're going to be passionate about. So that's what this ju judgment call is all about. It's about taking up new ventures. Now, this could be a million different things for a million different people. Whatever you're inspired to do, if you listen to your intuition and you reflect, reflect on the lessons you've learned here, take the time to do that, you will be drawn down a certain path. And you'll gain the enlightenment that you need. Now, this could be moving home. It could be moving job. It could be moving country. It could be going back to academic learning. Uh, it could be anything that you desire. But whatever this is, whatever you're drawn to do here, whatever your intuition is telling you, and whatever your lessons have taught you here, it's time for the new beginnings. And it's about taking that leap of faith forward and trusting your intuition here um, understanding as well that the universe will support you here because there's a leap of faith that's needed. And this is you putting trust in yourself and the universe here to be able to take up these new ventures and go forward with enthusiasm for life again, getting your mojo back here. So he travels very lightly. You can see that. If I say he or she, it's not gender specific, but you can see that he's flying through the air. He's leaving his challenges behind. And the reason that's happening is because he's starting this brand new journey from ground zero. So brand new opportunities present themselves here when we're prepared to look for them, when we're prepared to make that judgment call and decide that we're ready for new things here, new opportunities to come forward. Now, these are new opportunities for stability. So there could be any new contracts being signed here, new purchases, new homes, um, things, anything to do with finances. Like I say, it could even you be starting up your own business or doing a study course that eventually will help with financial security in the future. But whatever this venture is, it's going to serve you really, really well. You're going to be able to support yourself through time. You're going to be able to take up these opportunities that are going to be stable for you. Um, and what you're basically doing here is you're starting up a brand new life chapter. So you're going through this portal and you're shutting down these challenges. You're putting them behind you through choosing a brand new path and you're successfully going forward. And when you go forward, you will not look back here. You won't look back. And this is you coming into harmony with yourself. This is you and your higher self. You're well balanced. You're feeling good about things. So there's lots of treasures here for you to have. There's lots of these treasures. This treasure that we're talking about is being represented by the Ace of Wands, new opportunities and new ventures, uh, new opportunities for growth. There's lots of blessings here that can you can uh, that can um, you can acquire that will come forward uh, when you take up these new ventures. Now this can also be you if it could be a brand new relationship coming in a, pansa, a Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. It could be a new relationship of any kind. It could be romantic. It could be a friendship. It could be a tutor people relationship, any kind of relationship. Uh, but this person is somebody who's on the same page as you, that understands you and gets you, and somebody who would help and support you through uh, this time when you're trying to build things and you're starting off here. So it's good to be around people we can trust and people we can rely on. So friends, family members, um, people like that as well. It's always good to have them around. So there's lots of blessings wanting to come in that you can claim here, uh, but there's a judgment call that's needed uh, to put your challenges behind you. And if you're prepared to make a long-term commitment, commitment to this new venture of yours and put the hard work in, like I said earlier, this new opportunity for stability will grow. And this is um, you being able to sit back and enjoy the fruits of your labour. So commitment, long-term commitments needed here. If you put the work in, you will benefit. There will be financial security. There could be promotion and jobs, better paid jobs. You could become even the boss type energy. Okay, so let's see here. Spirit, show me clearly. Positive thinking. Positive thinking is vital in creating a healthy and abundant life. 
A positive attitude along with positive beliefs and thoughts are crucial ingredients for creating happiness. Don't worry, think love. So when you're doing your brainstorming, think positively about the challenges that you've been through and the lessons that you've learned here. Stay positive because it's the lessons that you've learned that are going to enable you to make this decision to get onto that new path. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.